Hello there, Capricorns! Once again, because once again, my husband decided to walk in and interrupt reading. I am going to be reading your cards for November of this current year, which is 2018. And welcome to Scorpio season, aka welcome to Jurassic Park. Don't go into the highlands or high grounds or high grass or whatever the hell that dude says, right? I am still doing personal readings for anyone who's interested. Your email's down in the description below. Uh, I'll probably still keep taking them until about um, December. And then I'll probably take a break for the Christmas holiday. So if you want one, get it in. So I'm not sure how the whole payment thing works out. I'm only getting paid a couple times, and I'm not even sure if they worked. So <laughs> who knows? I don't know. I'm not really all that worried about it. Either way. Um, but yeah, I don't remember what the hell we were talking about before, and I don't know if we're going to be continuing from the reading I had done for you before my husband walked in. Oh! Huh. Someone's being emotionally manipulative, Cancer, Pisces, Scorpio, and are they looking like a victor, or do you have victory over them? Like, beating the evil villain at their own game since it came up like that? Like, victory over your enemy in the church-like manner? Interesting. Hope my fellow caps are doing good today. Oh, there's a lie going around, though, or some perception of the truth is completely wonky. Hmm. We're going to see what's going on with all of us today, Capricorns. I don't know if it'll read for me, but this is a general reading, so if it doesn't resonate with you, don't worry about it. I might get you next time, I might not. All depends, really. Okay. No whammies. Alright, Capricorn, let's lay this spread out. I've been trying it like this for a while. Ooh. Ah, oh, that looks nothing like what I saw earlier. <laughs> eh, maybe a little bit. The beginning theme in all this is Page of Swords, Gemini, Libra, Aquarius. Someone is definitely fishing for some information. Somewhere. Don't know why. Could be an air sign, someone you're dealing with. But someone's definitely on the lookout to find something out, whether it be about you or some other shenanigans. Okay, so over here we got a cycle that doesn't feel complete, and some of you might be feeling upside down like the Queen of Pentacles reversed, which is our card, also Tauruses and Virgos. Uh, usually she could take care of herself, but she might be ending up a little bit selfish and codependent at the moment. Maybe even an enabler of sorts. But yeah, there was something that didn't get completed because of this. Because someone wasn't feeling themselves, so there wasn't a cycle complete. Now someone's having a hard time recover from that and like they're being a bit arrogant with this star reversed. Um, a lot of impotence, a lot of not wanting to listen to the rest of the cult and you know going against the grain a little bit like this is Aquarius's card too. But this leads also to someone wanting to keep their secrets just under the surface with the priestess reversed. Um, you know their secrets beneath the surface and they might come up but like Someone is trying their best to keep it where it is right now. Like, it's just underneath of the surface. Like, if, if, if there could be just one little trigger that'll, like, make all the secrets come out, you know. Stuff would be revealed. I, I, I think stuff is going to be revealed. What's going against that is that arrogance and shit like that, right? Like, someone not wanting to, um... I feel like, learn... Look, because here's the world, here's the star, here's somebody who manipulated and they're afraid of that manipulation caused them to lose the war when they gained a victory in a battle. You know, like, you may want to battle but you lost the war kind of thing. Because they just want to, because in the end they just want to be happy. Hmm. So a cycle didn't end and that left somebody feeling really arrogant, but fearful about some fights they've gotten into that resulted. 
like almost like somebody's waiting for somebody else to approach but they might as well just forget it because like those other people might not come back and it's keeping them a prisoner in their mind so we're like you know it doesn't feel authentic anymore as like all the waiting for somebody to come back to fight you it doesn't really work when people don't want to fight you you know and here's the page of swords with her sword up um ready to fight back all this past shit right like she's looking over all the stuff that's happened before she got here where now she's looking over all of this information she's gathered and it's just like i will swing my sword and smite all of thee if you cross this freaking line she's been watching all of this Like the little spy she is. Mind you, this is a general, so this doesn't resonate with you, whatever. But I, like, I don't know, Caps. This is like a really. Like, I hardly ever vibe with ours anyway, but it's like, this one's like really. distant to me. Like, the last time I did it, you know, before I found out I was prego. And I feel like I, I'm like harnessing that like air energy a little bit. I'm doing a lot more thinking than anything, which is really unusual to me. Like, I'm keeping a lot of my thoughts to myself. Uh, two cards just spun out the way. There's a bit of an unhappy home, and someone's coming to the point where they're needing to recover about this home being out of place a little bit. Like, it, the house isn't as valuable as what it once was. We have this Queen of Pentacles holding secrets. About what makes her happy. Will bring her abundance. Will bring her joy. Ah! I'm like, went on my neck. But there's a shitty offer with all of it. And that's part of the secret. I don't know. Maybe the high priestess will open up. Or maybe she'll stay fucking guarded. Like, you know, that just said. So, I guess that's no. <laughs> Jesus. Okay, that's fair. That's so why I like Rider Waite. They're very, very blunt. No whammies. Okay. So, laying out the rest of these cards. Ew. Someone thought they could sneak away. Now get noticed. There's a secret about someone's true feelings when it comes to a King of Cups. ending theme is going to be Page of Cups, who was also in the past looking. They're both looking in the past. Someone was offering their true feelings while holding up that sword ready to whack a mole at anybody and cut limbs off and like get the actual information. So someone I feel like they wanted to offer some feelings, but they needed to find some stuff out first, right? And this is like, you know, this right here is just awkward, Capricorns. Like, all the rest of this makes sense, but it's these two right here that get to me, like... Someone... Like, someone's regretting some manipulative tactics in order to win a battle. I feel like with a page of pentacle, which could be you, or it could be a child of yours, um, Capricorn. But I feel like somebody mani tried to manipulate this person. And it worked. But then the page of pentacle walked away. Like they had something to offer before, but now they're just walking away from this battle. And that was a fear. And maybe, or maybe they were afraid that, like, after you walked away, like, someone could be offering, possibly you, some value. Like, it isn't the best pinnacle. Look at how freaking crooked it is. But it's a pinnacle. And that's what counts in this, right? And what lies below it, which is kind of the catalyst, like, all this abundance in a house that, like, 
is all messed up, all just screwed up, right? You know, the world's upside down, like, something didn't get, like, something, like, the cycle didn't end because someone thought that they could get away with this shit. They could just sneak away, and they could leave these two swords behind, and they wouldn't be a bother, but the swords became more evidence than anything. Like, these swords are now reminders of them sneaking away. Whether that be you or a person you're dealing with, Capricorn, but, like... This person thought they could get away, and and futility reversed, right? Like, these swords are now just, like, almost... It's kind of like the victims of a lycanthrope showing up in a ghost form to haunt them. Because that's usually what happens with lycanthropes. Like, whoever they murder, they follow them until that lycanthrope is dead, for the most part. That's part of the curse. They're constantly, like, haunted. But those spirits also act like guides as well. They also rot a lot. And that kind of left this Queen of Pentacles who was a bit reversed, right? Needing to be like a hermit. Could be a Virgo. But definitely needing to collect themselves and look inward in order to deal with the situation where someone just thought that they could get away with leaving this cycle closing wrong and now it's like they're haunted by, I, like I said that the other day on my Instagram like I, like I like using the little type thing to write little statuses and I can share them out and I was like I will leave you haunted and that's kind of how that feels like the world didn't get complete it's another haunted by these two swords and leaving this queen of pentacle almost like in hermit mode trying to recover like a Virgo would going inward to analyze and inspect and such like that then we got the high priestess where someone's just like keeping their feelings hidden about this king of cups scorpio pisces cancer type um he can be really in tune with his emotions but he feels like he can be above them too like i feel like he's really emotionally unavailable <laughs> like he's got this cup but it's empty like you you can actually see pretty deep into the cup like look there's even shadow past the rim so you can see pretty deep in the cup and it's like it's so empty like he easily like just fill the cup up with water like it's all over around but he doesn't want to like i feel like he's really emotionally unavailable like he's probably he'll probably open up but it's like you have to get him to open up because he won't do it for you and in a way that's kind of unfair you know like gonna keep your feelings to yourself until like someone else brings it up cause like you're not even gonna show if, there, if you had anything to drink in that cup you know like that like that kind of like stupid rude boy kind of like way you know like well how do you feel i didn't well how do you feel you know and then like they ask you the same question back being like motherfucker i told i asked you first then we got somebody who was er arrogant down below and that caused them not to be able to manifest everything like everything kind of backfired on them and maybe that's the secret being kept by this king of cups this is what you want. This is what's going against you. Someone was arrogant in what they created and it backfired. That might be being kept a secret by this King of Cups. Or maybe it's involving this King of Cups too. Right? Oh, first card. Liar, liar. <laughs> Look at that. Look at that. Queen of Wands reverse. Possibly dealing with Fire Sign, Leo, Sagittarius, Aries. Um, possibly someone who knows some things but isn't going to come forward with any information isn't talking isn't like really showing their best skin As if, and if you follow the quietest revelation on YouTube we Capricorns are supposedly supposed to be having the tallest skin crack shot but this person like Whoever skin this is, it is, um, it's tr 
truly not the best two colors that you shine, you know? Like, it doesn't have to be the fire sign. It could be somebody emulating it or somebody who has it in their chart somewhere. But it's like someone is not showing their um, most best behavior. Like, they're not, the, they're not displaying... Um, not class, not manners, courtesy. They're not displaying, like, how kind they can be. All they're showing is their ass. When dealing with this whole, like... Queen of Pentacles reverse needing to go into hermit mode and someone trying to sneak away. This person's like acting like their shit doesn't stink like yours does, right? Oop. And that's caused some stall in um fate right now. Everything stopped. The Wheel of Fortune, like this is Sagittarian energy, right? It is stalled. Nothing is moving. Nothing's happening. Like, the devil's got it stuck right there. And, you know, like, if the devil's here, I'm surprised he ain't showed up anywhere else, Caps. But, yeah, like, this energy is stalled, possibly for this person who played the Magician Reverse and the King of Cups. Like, all of this right here, like, whatever was manifested and backfired, like, it's just stopped everything. And this person's too busy, like being stuck in themselves to admit it, I feel like. A, a, a couple cards. Ooh, I think a couple cards flipped up. We got, like, the Eight of Swords reversed. Oh, I'm checking to see if there's any other cards that flipped up. No? Okay. But yeah, like, okay, Eight of Swords reversed, right? In this entire scenario, someone's really stuck on this, you know? Like, someone is really, um... Stuck on how they dealt with this page of pentacles person and, you know, the ten of cups with the four of wands reversed. Someone's really stuck on the fact that, like, like, I feel like someone wanted more. That was the ten of cups. Like, they got what they wished for and it totally screwed something up in the house. It, 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 it disrupted the piece. And they realize, like, they did wrong to this page of Pentacle, and now they're kind of stuck with that emotional strain. Right? It's almost like someone got their karma. Both the world and, you know, the Wheel of Fortune are here. All I'm missing is, like... justice and it's like this is all like like i feel like someone is getting their comeuppance in this but i don't feel like this is you capricorn i feel like this is someone you've been dealing with like someone is getting themselves stuck and causing themselves to go through this because they won't change their attitude They won't stop, like, trying to walk away from a situation they messed up, I feel like. But that's up for you to decide. But that was your reading, Capricorns, and I will see you later. Bye-byes.